All right, people, welcome back. More vitamin Y. So today is Wednesday, and that means that we are using Eboxies, the combo deck of combos. So hopefully I get a decent hand and we can pull off some of these combos. Eboxies is an interesting one. When, when, when I pull off the combos, I mean, they're pretty cool and pretty powerful and pretty unique. But when I don't, the deck just kind of just fumbles. So, yeah. Well, I got Eris, so I didn't open up terrible. This kind of sucks that, you know, I can't go Dark Graph or pitch Eris, send someone in and get Eris effect. Uh, but overall, the hand's not terrible. I mean, I'm still going to send her, though, with Dark Graph, because I want her in the graveyard anyway. Yeah, I want her in the graveyard. I'm going to normal summon. I said I'm going to normal summon. Thank you. Okay. So, yeah, that sucks that I don't get Aerith effect when I, uh, pitch her. Now, when I send her, like, when she's the one going from the deck to the graveyard with Dark Graffer, I get the effect, but not from the pitch. It sucks. It really does. <laughs> I'm guessing that's fine, because my opponent here is not even responding, so I'll go ahead and send Eris. Eris. I mean, and then we'll go ahead and send you Bell, and bam, we're pretty much set up. And this card just says... This card is integrated by a card effect, so I could I could actually uh foolish send uh uh Shadal Dragon and Shadal Dragon will go ahead and pop at least one of his back row. I forgot I had Shadal Dragon in here actually, but you know it it, it serves double. Send Shadal Dragon, pop a back row, but also send Shadal Dragon for uh Masculine. It's one of the things that's left over from uh uh Shadal Ubel. Okay, I guess he doesn't want to chain, which is fine. I guess you guys know it's an interesting card. Oh! I haven't seen this deck in a millennium, so... This should be... interesting, to say the least. Usually, usually when I ran you bell, I could take your Giyakata Curry. You know what, I shouldn't have set these cards. I was thinking of setting them because, you know, but I could actually Black Rose, so. Yeah, that's fine. Yeah, I could actually Black Rose. Like, Giga Giyakata Curry, it's been a cool minute since I've seen this deck. Ever since, you know, that card that should have been hit to one got hit down to one, no one's really been touching the deck, so it's interesting to see it, to say the least. Well, I probably summon Mask Chameleon, Mask Chameleon, summon back Eris, go into Black Rose, activate Black Rose effect, chain, call the haunted, summon you bell, then get destroyed and summon terror. If I survive this attack. After summon X C D touch summon X C D touch summon X C D touch summon X C D. I oh my god! Like have you seen something so fucking repetitive? That uh six hundred. Oh okay. Limiter removal, alright, so you double your attack, so I take just your additional attack, right? You got MST? Well, 
when you declare the attack with the second one. You're like, oh, I'm gonna go for it. Yeah. Yes. Response. You wanna get you wanna get greedy? You wanna fucking try to go for game? How about you bail block? Are you fucking shitting me? Wow. Alright. Like, thanks fucking fucking DN for giving my opponent all the cards. Like really this? Wow. <sighs> yeah, I can't even survive that. Wow. 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 Wow, thanks. Fucking Dion. You wanted me to get my ass beat today. You could have just told me so. Like, really? Of course it's compulse. Of course. Of course. Could have fucking dragged the other one. If I would have dragged that, I would have been totally fine. But nope. Dragging the wrong fucking card. Ugh. <sighs> Let's get another duel in. Luck. One of the epitomes of Yu-Gi-Oh. No, oh, totally ready to go ahead and activate message in a bottle. Oh, well, that's nice. This hand's actually really good. I opened up really well. They already got monsters with Three monsters with different levels. Of course, you're gonna blind space me. I'll go ahead and chain. Let's go ahead and summon terror. Alright. That was just dumb. I'm like, really? Of course. I've been so advantageous if I could have survived that. All the monsters would have been gone. It would have been just, it would have just been fantastic. But nope. Oop, that is totally wrong. Uh, that is wrong. Hit root zero way too many times. One too many times. The difference between 2,000 and 20,000. 20, 20,000 life points. <laughs> I was just, I was just like, wow, dragon, only you pop the other monster. Alright, that's a summon, normal summon. I hate raid raptors because they take forever for their turns and they're boring. Just wanted to tell you guys that they're, they're boring. This, this is the play that they do all the time. This, send this, this, banish, search for, you know, usually they're nests, but I'm not even sure if you're going to do that because, you know, you don't have two uh, raid raptors. Overall, I just find the deck really boring and repetitive. Really just boring and repetitive. They're supposed to be like an XC deck, but, you know, sometimes I don't even see them, or a rank up deck, on. sometimes I don't even see them do that. I just see them do the repeat repeat plays over and over and over and over. It's like a it's like a two card engine with these two. Like this. Send this, this, banish this, this, search for this. You know, it's like, oh, okay. Do it again, do it again, do it again. It's like it's like Chrome I <laughs> just do the same repeating engine. Castell? Go ahead and go into Castell. It's not that hard. Castell, spin back my terror. Yep. Surprise, surprise.
Mm-hmm. Ah, oh, fuck it. Let's try to black rose him. Almost something. Okay. So I'll probably go Mask Chameleon, Mask Chameleon, summon back, uh, uh, I don't have to think about just summoning you, Bell. Not so many Bell. No, because if he wants the Icarus attack, then, you know, if he was waiting to, you know, for me to summon like that, if I would have summoned Eris and he Icarus attacked me, though, then gone, right? Oh, this, if he Icarus, Icarus attacks me, you know, at least I get Terror. Watch I get, watch I get Castell again. I wouldn't stop this, not really. Let's go ahead. So if I set this and he acres attacks in here, just you know. Give your shit. If you're gonna acres attack, take these two out. You know, at least I get tear. Of course this is the wing beast as well. It's probably really you better to see if he does Icarus while I get the effect. And if he castells me again, then I'm pretty much out of this duel. If he goes out and castell, castell spin back my Ebel. That's it. Man, this is a long second, sir. Like the world's longest second. You got till thirteen to do you, thirteen minutes to do your play. If you don't do a play, I'm gonna quit and get another duel in. So maybe I can squeeze one more duel into this video. You were just about to get it, too. I said 13, you went exactly on 13. Now you better not take fucking forever in your turn. Oh wait, I'm dueling against fucking Ray Raptors, of course he is. And take a goddamn millennium. See, I told you, this plague is so repetitive. All right, send mimicry, mimicry, banners, dudes. Like, oh my god. God, I do not like raid raptors because they're just boring and repetitive. Oh, shocker, he sent mimicry. Like, it's so boring. It's not even good. Like, if you're, if you're going to be repetitive, at least be good. You know, at least be necros where they're, they're repetitive, but at least they're good. This deck's not even good. <sighs> so bored, so bored. This deck is boring.
No, maybe I should have just black rose your ass, because this is just getting boring and repetitive. too many times. Tear. Still not gonna set the call. There's really no point right now. I'll just set my turn. You want Icarus attack? Do it now. Alright. So let's see if you're just gonna go into another cast down and cast down me again. Oh yeah, I'm actually gonna see some Red Raptor monsters. Castell again. Hollow, oh, you're just gonna rank up into uh to C101. Yep. Alright. Which can take all special summon monsters. <sighs> Getting mad. One more duel. Perfect. Pitch dark grab for Sunny Bell. Set the limit reverse. Wow. Alright. Thank God I didn't draw that. I'd rather pitch a dark grab for a dark grab than ever a new bell like that. It was Ultimate Nightmare than Terror, so I shoveled the deck, so you know, let's see if I'm just gonna draw the same thing. I mean it's called shuffle for a reason. I'm not shuffling very well, you know. Draw the same exact shit. Okay. It, you're not gonna do anything? I'm not gonna do anything. Wow. What a fun duel. Poking you for 17. Go ahead. More background, awesome. I'll just keep poking. I am not in a hurry to beat you. Just keep poking. No point in summoning, no point in doing anything. As long as my attacks go through. Wow. What a great duel, huh guys? Me just poking my opponent. Wow. So last turn. Tell me what you got. This is it. Alright, especially some cyber dragon. Activate this diffusion, summon not him, go into Nova, go into Infinity. Uh I'm sitting here, he's like, oh, I'm gonna give my life points to barely scraping and then I'm just gonna go into Infinity. Like, okay, sure. See if I can bait him. I guess someone can back around. They probably like Infinity plus back row. Like, I'm probably gonna lose this duel. Got my opponent down to 200 life points, and he'll probably just come back.
have no idea how many tech out of infinity. That's fine. I'll keep the 29. You do have Cyber Dragon now. It's risky to summon that core. And I have 200 life points left. You're gonna go for it though. Which means that you probably have Honest. Oh, you have machine dupe. This duel went from fucking I can't I can't I can't Infinity so fucking stupid. Two hundred fucking life points, can you believe that? Well, if he has honest I'm fucked. Pretty much I'm gonna summon and try to attack and he's gonna be like honest and I'm gonna be like, Yep, that's it. There's no way I can get past two fucking Novas. I mean, two Infinities. Like, that's straight up impossible in the game of Yu Gi Oh! What, you think about going in Pleiades instead? Nope, nope, another infinity. Oh, oh, he wants this. Alright. Infinity is so fucking busted. There is no reason to make this card. Well, uh, let's see. Almost summon. Okay. Go ahead, read him. There's nothing to read. I'm just gonna try to attack into your core, and if you block me or hit me, then I fucking lose. Cause you're just gonna go negate, 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 negate. So, honest. Some piece of background. Air Force. Oh, yep. Yep, that is game. There is no way I can take two infinities. Infinity is so stupid. Nice job! Fucking Infinity so busted. Got you down 200 life points. Huh? But hey, people, life points don't fucking matter as long as you got resources and fucking two solemn judgment ass monsters. I can't do shit about that. I can't do shit about that. This video is terrible. Oh well, I'm putting it up. I don't care. I don't got time to re record. So, uh, I hope you guys enjoyed the fucking bullshit that I go through. So, uh, thanks for watching, thanks for all the support, and I'll see you guys tomorrow, probably losing with Cosmic Key Bell. Thanks for watching.